Hit it with a left, hit it with a right. I'ma knock the pussy out like fight night. Atlanta's superstar trio Migos has had a monumental year. Since the beginning of 2018, they've been nominated for two Grammys, won an American Music Award, and a BET Award. Yes, sir! Quavo and Takeoff both released highly anticipated solo projects in 2018, and Offset's album is reportedly on the way. Their busy year has led many fans to revisit an age-old question. Who's the best Migo? I never heard about Migos, but you must be crazy. Huh? Yeah. Migos have been in the rap game since 2011, and their early mixtapes like Jug Season, No Label, and Young Rich Niggas propelled them to the forefront of a new wave of rap. When did you feel like people started paying attention to you? The uh, bando, I said the bando. Yeah, the bando song. Trapping out the house with the boys on the window. Yeah. Trapping out the house with the boys on the windows. Tried out the bando. Tried out the bando. Since then, Migos has released a number of mixtapes and studio albums, and their distinct ad libs and unmistakable triplet flow quickly took over hip hop. For such a for such a Medusa head on me like I'm Illuminati. Hey, hey. I, I, I know that you'd like it for such a my neck and my wrist is so sloppy. Their fame hit new levels in late 2016 when they dropped Bad and Bougie, which spent three weeks at number one on the Hot 100. And despite some controversy around one member not being on the hit song. You say I'm left off Bad and Bougie? What you say? You say I'm left off Bad and Bougie? Yeah. Do it look like I'm left off Bad and Bougie? Most fans can agree that each one brings something different to the table. Quavo, who's often considered the front man, is known for his hooks. He's been featured on tracks with a number of pop artists, including Madonna, Liam Payne, and Justin Bieber. Mama told you don't talk to strangers. But when you run in that drop, you can't explain it. In December 2017, Quavo and Travis Scott released their collaborative project, Huncho Jack, Jack Huncho, which debuted at number one on the top R&B and hip hop album chart. Quavo's own solo project, Quavo Huncho, was released almost a year later and peaked at number two on the Billboard 200. Including features, Quavo's had 21 songs on the Hot 100, with five top 10 hits and a number one, courtesy of DJ Khaled. Quavo, I'm the one that hit that same spot. Next up is Offset, known for his ad libs. Raindrop, drip, drop top, drop top, smoking, no cooking, the hot box. Cookies. And we also saw him collaborating on some non Migo related projects in 2017. In October, he dropped Without Warning, along with 21 Savage and Metro Boomin, which peaked at number four on the Billboard 200 chart. Offset's had 12 songs on the Hot 100, including his features, and two top 10 hits. Niggas be cloning, I find it funny. Clone. <laughs> Last but not least, there's Takeoff, whose distinct voice provides a noticeable contrast to the rest of the group. In November 2018, he dropped The Last Rocket, his debut solo project, and it received a lot of critical acclaim. So far, Takeoff has had two songs on the Hot 100, his feature on Huncho Jack's Eye to Eye and his recent track, Last Memory. So we've laid out the stats. Why is it so hard to choose a favorite Migo? Fans are quick to point out that lyrically, both Takeoff and Offset consistently deliver standout verses. All my niggas on the rumble on commando. We the first one that came out with the bando. Talking about you got the elbow, what they going for? I'm about to start a story, niggas, for that Migo flow. Be in the walk, biggie and pop. Whoa. But we so different, we keep in the glove. Wow. I'm on the yacht and the yacht on my wife. Yes. Fucking the thought on the ocean, Dubai. But Quavo and Offset have their own thoughts. My opinion, he the best. He the best one out of all of us, you know what I'm saying? He the youngest. Yeah, do that, he man. been yeah, like man. that. Man. To me, he the best one. Uh -oh. To me, he the best one out the group. Everybody watch out, boy. The boy, take off on the way. As a group, Migos' recent albums have dominated the charts. They earned their first number one album on the Billboard 200 with Culture, and Culture 2 followed a year later. And they've got the Hot 100 on lock. Migos has a total of 33 songs in the Hot 100, ranging from early breakout tracks like Handsome and Wealthy, to newer hits like Walk It, Talk It. Walk it like I talk it. Walk it. Walk it like I talk it. Walk it. Walk it like I talk it. Woo. Walk it like I talk it. Hey. Walk it like I talk it. And based off those numbers, maybe the best things do come in threes. Do you remember my teacher say we would make it? Said I would make it. Woo. I gotta thank y'all. Yeah, and made us famous. Hey. I'm Tia with Genius News, bringing you the meaning and the knowledge behind the music. You gotta be like an octopus. We got a whole lot of arms. You dig? Spaghetti Junction, we wanna know. Walk it like I talk it. Walk it. Walk it like I talk it. Walk yeah. it. Walk it like I talk it. Talk it. Walk it like I talk it. Woo.